Hello friends. Welcome to our video learning channel. Accurate. ASME. ISO. In this video, let's learn the inspection methods of angularity tolerances. Conventional measurement and CMM both. Please do not forget to subscribe the channel and share the video. Let us have a drawing of the part as shown. The angularity of inclined surface is given 0.2 mm with respect to the datum surface A. The basic angle given is 30 degrees. Whereas the meaning of the control applied is graphically animated in below. With respect to datum A, at the basic angle of 30 degrees, the applicable tolerance is two parallel plane zone. Angle and the angularity can be measured with a sine bar. The sine bar is a hardened precision round and lap tool used in different settings. It consists of an accurately ground flat steel, straightage with precisely affixed round rollers with defined distance apart and of identical diameters. Its working principle is based on trigonometric function. Sine angle is equal to opposite height upon hypotenuse size. Making for the equipment arrangement, First calculate the height h by the trigonometric function. Center distance between the rollers is known as well as diameter of the rollers. For the required orientation, at 30 degrees, maintain a nominal h height calculated with stacking the slip gauges. Once the setup is ready use the dial indicator with height gauge and move along the surface as shown in animation. The minimum to maximum variation shown in the readings is known as the angularity. Please remember angularity here controls the basic angle as well as the form error in common tolerance zone of two parallel planes. In case of the round and conical components, the same sign bar arrangement can be used, with certain modifications. Here, it is required to use between center on the sign bar, to hold the component axially. The remaining measurement procedure would be same as in case of the flat surfaces. In some cases there is compound angle on the part available. It become a little difficult to inspect but it is surely possible with arrangement as shown. It is necessary to have two different blocks with different angles and they are stacked as in the figure. Rest of the measurement procedure remain the same. A special checking gauge also can be built for the customized solution. It is dedicated arrangement with fixed angle and calibrated for the accuracies. A master must be developed for the quick verification of the gauge. Mostly it is very appreciated in mass production and inspection required for large sample batches. Accuracy of gauge and dial indicator resolution decides the uncertainty of the measurement. Three coordinate measuring machines, normally popular with name CMM, are very versatile, accurate, faster and user-friendly machines. All the geometric tolerances are perfectly measured with high accuracy. Automatic programmable measurement alone removes the skill errors. 
while measuring on the CMM machine following simple procedure after the completion of prerequisites like probe calibration, etc. Measure a surface of datum plane. Measure a surface of tolerance plane. Open the window of geometric tolerance and select the angularity. Input datum plane number in datum option and tolerance plane number in tolerance feature option. Input the nominal value if insisted as 0.00. Input the angularity basic angle given in the drawing. Input the angularity tolerance value as given in the drawing. The value after the calculation will be reported in mm. The most important suggestion to follow while measuring geometric tolerances is that the number of points must be increased than usual to get the better accuracy of the measurement. In coming videos you would also find a video on probing and probing points. Hope that you have liked this video, with very easy and simple explanations. You can comment how do you see this initiative and suggest more on upcoming videos. Also we are pleased to conduct training programs at your locations in factories. We offer AUCOM Germany, an international CMM certification course. Basic of GDNT. Advanced GDNT. Stack up tolerances. Surface finish. MSA and other quality tools. For further details, please contact us. And I'm sure you will encourage the initiative of training through YouTube, by subscribing a channel. Accurate, ASME, ISO. Thank you and have a good day.